flight the day before the rest of the team to get a good night's sleep like they do in the majors. He didn't realize major league teams did that. He was pretty envious of the concept. But here's Yoshida, 29-year-old, uh, the last seven seasons with the Oryx Buffaloes, and he takes strike one. One of the more interesting storylines around camp is Yoshida's development and how his skills in the Pacific League and the Nippon Professional Baseball League transfer now to Major League Baseball. Yeah, I think that's, as he files that one, that that's probably the biggest question. How do the numbers, how does his game translate? This is a guy the last five years hit over 300 each year, had an over a 400 on base each year with a 500 uh, slugging percentage each and every year the last five years. How does it translate? If you see some of the projections or talk to some of the people in the Red Sox, they believe in him. He's going to be a fun guy to watch. And there's a, there's a lot of juice in this guy's swing. He hits balls a long way. Batting cleanup today, but uh, projected right now to be the leadoff hitter for the team. He drives this one to left field. Spun around a bit, but getting back after it is Feinberg. Coming in to score is Devers, a sack fly for Yoshida, and a 2 nothing lead for the Red Sox. You hear a lot about has a good at-bat here. Yoshida sitting there 0-2. Gets a fastball from Quinn Living, outer half. Doesn't try to pull it, stays on that ball. Barrels it to left field, just a low line drive, but enough to get the sack fly. The bat-to-ball skill is undeniable for Yoshida, a left-handed hitter who has recorded more walks than strikeouts in each of his last four seasons. 